Today I'll explain about the strange blinds at the front of a Peugeot 308, why they're installed, how they function, and whether you should be worried about them. Let's get started. Firstly, not all Peugeot 308s with a T9 body type have these blinds installed, so your car might not have them. I personally have a 1.6 HDI engine with 120 horsepower installed in mine. This is probably the most common diesel engine on these Peugeots, and yes, my car has these blinds as well. Let's discuss what they are and why they're installed in a car. To be exact, these aren't blinds, but a controlled air intake module. Why is this module installed and why complicate the car design? The primary reason, ensuring aerodynamics. In standard mode, this module, this grill, is closed, which improves aerodynamics and hence saves fuel. Honestly, for the first few months after purchasing the car, I didn't even realize that I had such a cooling system installed. The second is the cooling of the engine and the electric traction circuit. Without complicating things, in normal driving mode, this module is closed. The aerodynamics are good, fuel is saved, everything is good. As soon as the temperature reaches a certain value, the computer gives the command to activate the module. Aerodynamics slightly worsen, but the temperature stabilizes. After that, the module closes and we move on, roughly like this. It's impossible to tell whether the grill is open or not by sound, vibration, RPM or other criteria. It's impossible only visually or through a computer. In other words, there's no discomfort at all for the driver, which is good. Next, the third, when the car stops, the flaps may remain open for subsequent ventilation, so don't be alarmed if you see the flaps either open or closed in the parking lot. As long as you don't get an error, everything is fine. Everything works in the normal mode. Speaking of mistakes, I've had my car for about a year and there's been no trouble. This system works like a clockwork. There have been isolated cases of system errors, but it's not a common occurrence. I managed to find this error code. Not all mechanics understand what this is. This might be useful to someone. If you search the internet, you can find information that a similar system was also installed in Peugeot 3008, for instance. Maybe this information will be useful to someone. Point four, what is this module for? It cools down the temperature in the power steering circuit. It seems unexpected, but it's true. I repeat, in almost a year of usage, I've only seen the flaps open once. It was a hot summer day, nearly 40 degrees Celsius. Maybe I haven't been paying enough attention, but still. Regarding the design and repair of this system, the setup is quite simple. Here is our entire module. The car's brain sends a signal, precisely a block over the LIN network, that the blinds need to be opened or closed. Accordingly, the electric motor starts operating, it rotates the leading blind, which moves the control rod. And with this rod, the driven blinds are moved, that is all except the top one. The system is quite simple. In terms of repair, I'll reiterate, the problem isn't widespread, so there's very limited solutions to the hiccups. Typically, either the rod or the blind fasteners come off or break. To try to rectify everything as it was, you need a pit. After removing the front plastic protection, you can get there without removing the bumper. The rest is highly individual. Possible causes of the malfunction. The first is, of course, the electric. Motor wearing out also likely is a bad connection in the connector to the same motor. Don't discount a physical object getting stuck in the blind, a stone, twig, bird, or a mechanical breakdown, or wear of some kind of hinge, so to speak. I hope this information will help you purely for informative purposes. If it helps someone in terms of repair or diagnosing the malfunction, you're welcome. If you have anything to add, don't hesitate. Write in the comments, ask questions, let's gather information together, and that's all I have for today. Good luck on the roads for now.